The United States has proposed a deal to sell 330 million US dollar in arms to Taiwan, in another move that will risk infuriating Beijing and add further tension to strained US-China relations. Taiwan said the proposal announced by US defense officials on Monday would help bolster the self-ruled island's defenses, but Beijing said it violated the One China principle. A commentary by the overseas edition of Communist Party mouthpiece People's Daily said the arms deal represented interference in China's domestic politics and violated China's sovereignty. We call on the US to cancel the deal and cut off military ties with Taiwan to avoid causing damage to China's military relations and peace in the Taiwan Strait, the commentary said. The proposal will go before the US Congress and covers spare parts for F-16, C-130 and F-5 indigenous defense fighter jets, and other aircraft systems. This proposed sale will contribute to the foreign policy and national security of the United States by helping to improve the security and defensive capability of the recipient, which has been and continues to be an important force for political stability, military balance and economic progress in the region, the Pentagon's Defense Security Cooperation Agency said in a statement. Beijing regards Taiwan as a breakaway province to be reunited with the mainland, by force if necessary. It had previously warned Washington against selling weapons to Taiwan and establishing military relations with the island, and remains locked in a trade war with the US. Taiwan's presidential office welcomed the move. We greatly appreciate that the US government takes note of the national security of Taiwan and its commitments to firmly abide by the Taiwan Relations Act and six assurances regarding US policy towards the island, office spokesman Alex Huang said. He said the latest weapon sales could also help boost the island's confidence in facing security challenges from Beijing, and strengthen the island's ability to ensure cross-strait and regional peace and stability, thereby improving cross-strait relations. We will continue to increase our investment in national defense, boost our defense industry and technology development, and closely cooperate and communicate with the U.S. on various security issues and agendas," Huang said. The six assurances, issued by former U.S. President Ronald Reagan in 1982, include the U.S. pledging not to set a date for ending arms sales to Taiwan, not to hold prior consultations with Beijing on arms sales to Taipei, and not to play a mediation role between the two sides of the Taiwan Strait.